Let's try to determine which is a bigger number. Is it that 50 to the power 50 is bigger or 49 to the power 51 is bigger? It is sufficient to know if this ratio 50 to the power 50 by 49 to the power 51 is bigger than 1 or less than 1. If this ratio is bigger than 1, we know that numerator is bigger. If this ratio is less than 1, then denominator is bigger. Now this question has got something to do with calculus. If you remember, limit n tends to infinity, 1 plus 1 by n, whole thing to the power n equal to e. Let's see how is it that this limit is related to this question. Let's try to write everything in term of 49. Uh, 50 can be written as, sorry, 50 to the power 50 can be written as 50 to the power 49 plus 1. 49 to the power 51 can be written as 49 to the power 49 plus 2. That's equal to 50 to the power 49 into 50 divided by 49 to the power 49 into 49 square by law of indices. That's again equal to, as we said earlier, we want to write everything in term of 49, or sorry, most of the thing in term of 49. So we write it as 49 plus 1 to the power 49 divided by 49 to the power 49 into 50 by 49 square. You see that here power remains same. So we can write this as 49 by 49 plus 1 by 49 whole thing to the power 49 into 50 divided by 49 square. Now we see that 49 gets cancelled. You have 1 plus 1 by 49 to the power 49. 1 plus 1 by n to the power, sorry. We, want, we are talking about limit n tends to infinity 1 plus 1 by n to the power n. You see here 1 plus 1 by 49 to the power 49. Now you get the same thing if you take n equal to 49. Okay. Now, 1 plus 1 by n, whole thing to the power n equal to e. If you know this, well and good. If you do not know, then also we can do. Uh, let's take n equal to 1. 1 plus 1 by 1 to the power 1 equal to 2. That's less than 3. We know that e is less than 3. For n equal to 2, 1 plus 1 by 2 whole thing square equal to 1.5 square equal to 2.25 again less than 3. In this way if you do, uh, if you take n equal to 10 say, 1 plus 1 by 10 whole thing to the power 10 equal to something 2 point something and that is again less than 3. In particular, if you take n equal to 49, 1 plus 1 by 49 to the power 49 is less than 3. That's exact the number we are talking about. Into 50 by 49 square as it is. So we have started with the ratio 50 to the power 50 divided by 49 to the power 51. Therefore, 50 to the power 50 divided by 49 to the power 51 is equal to, as we have shown earlier, 1 plus 1 by 49 to the power 49 into 50 by 49 square and this quantity as you have seen is less than 3 so this everything is less than 3 into 50 by 49 square 
But 3 into 50 by 49 squared is less than 1. So we observe that the ratio is less than 1. Therefore, 50 to the power 50 is less than 49 to the power 51. And we are done.